How you guys and girls doing today? Timson 918 here. Do not hate, appreciate y'all. So remember when I told you guys um, that I had a monster spawner? Well, take a look at this, y'all. So remember, I don't know if I showed y'all this, but look at all the way up here in these beautiful clouds. You can see the wonderful snow. You have ice, you've got snow, you've got it all, man, you know? I should be very careful. Um, and what I did was, so, you know, this is the chute that we can build all the way up. What you're meant to do is stay up here for a little bit. Or even go AFK, like I said in the last video. And what ends up happening is that the monsters will spawn. And, uh, yeah, when you come back down, see what I did? I made uh, a waterfall here so I can just fall down. And I can just get down here so much faster. Now, watch. You're going to hear a whole bunch of monsters in here, hopefully. There you go. And as you know, that's how you know that the monster spawner is working. What I like to do is I like to come through here, run around a little bit. Some people say that when you run around, it gets them to, you know, track you through the stone, which then will end up have them falling. And maybe sometimes I'll even sit right here. Sometimes the issue that I found with it though is that like spiders might get caught on the corners So sometimes the spiders might get caught on the corners and what that what that'll end up doing is it will end up trapping them or, or like trapping the spawns cutting off the spawns so no new monsters can spawn in and um, But it's all good. So I stay there for a couple of seconds as you can see, you're starting to hear more spider noises and less zombie and skeleton and creeper noises, which often means that a lot of them have fallen to the bottom. Then what we do is I use this second waterfall to come back down here. <gasps> oh, almost died. And like this, I can even stand here sometimes. And that's what I'll do, actually. Sometimes I'll stand here. Sometimes I'll go around a little bit. You can, you can still hear the creepers and everything else falling. So, I'll stand here. Oh, yeah. Like I always said at the beginning of my videos, y'all. Timson 918 is here. Do not hate. Appreciate, baby. And, um, y'all, so we have quite a few updates. So, you know, this is how the monster spawner works, right? So, let me just collect this real quick and show y'all. So, I'm level 7, and I'll tell y'all the reason for that in a second. So... Look at that. So we got from level 7 to level 13, so almost a 2x right there, which is great to see. Also, it'll collect things down here as well. And I've been just leaving the majority of stuff because this is a hopper, so it'll end up collecting stuff down here. And I just like to leave whatever it collects in the chest. And, um, yeah, y'all, so what happens is, you know, I have to stay close to that in order for it to uh, spawn in things. But it's not bad. Once again, I can crawl back up to the top and go AFK, but I'm not going to do that right now. Um... And, uh, yeah, so we got some phantom membranes because some phantoms spawned in because I had not slept for a couple of days. And, uh, you know, y'all, here's the crazy thing. We got two major updates. Number one, remember when I, t that's an enderman over there. That's two of them. Remember when I told y'all that I went into the nether or one time I was out and about minding my business like a good Samaritan and, oh, I forgot my render distance. Sorry, y'all. I don't know why. Y'all, I have a 1080 Ti and an i7 7820X uh, fucking processor. I have no clue why my FPS is in, at 30 on Minecraft. I know I'm playing at 1440p, but that is fucking insane. Like, there's no excuse for that. I don't know what my settings are. I'm pretty sure some Minecraft experts out there, for those, if anyone watches this video, if you help me out, I would deeply appreciate that. Um, but remember when I told y'all that I was out and about running around out here and there was a creeper and a spider and I went around the side of my portal and I went to the front of my house and the uh, spider and creeper went into my nether portal and my mod was like, hey, what if I told you that when you go into the nether, they're going to be waiting for you on the other side now. And I thought he was lying. Um, yeah, I thought he was Cap, and I was like, oh, man, that, that's a joke, or, you know, they'll eventually disappear. No, they did not, y'all. I was level 30 fucking two when I went in there. Good thing I have enchanted everything else, though, baby. 
I got the fully enchanted diamond set with the fully enchanted diamond pickaxe and sword. And I did that just before I went in there, just in case. And I shit you not, when I went into the nether, the creeper was there. Before I could even move, it blew me up. As you can see, when it blew up, it didn't blow up obsidian because creepers aren't strong enough to blow up obsidian. But it blew up the damn portal itself. So I spawned in, I heard the sizzle. Before I could even take a step, I instantly blew up and fucking died. I lost everything to this little lava pool right here. I only had like some iron armor on and it wasn't too crazy. As you can see, I already got a new set and I lost my tools and a little bit of food. And uh, yeah, oh, oh, I need magma cubes too. Ooh, I need those. And that's another thing too. So you know what? I gotta remember that. So yeah, you know, that's kind of convenient though. It's a good thing and a bad thing. I lost all that damn experience, but I don't need it anymore right now because I'm not concerned about enchanting anything else. And, uh, yeah, another positive thing. They put another portal right in here. They just spawned it like this. That's pretty convenient to have the nether portal in here. I don't have to worry about gas blowing it up, even though I have a flint and steel. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty nice. Another thing that I've also discovered, and I had no idea um, that it was uh, a thing, is that, and I know a lot of Minecraft experts might want to laugh at me or cook me up for this, and that's understandable. I did not know that you needed magma cream and uh, blaze powder, I believe it is, in order to... Oh, give me that gunpowder, bitch. I did not know that you needed blaze... Uh, yeah, blaze powder and... What else was it? Yeah, blaze powder and magma cubes in order to start the um the process to get fire resistance potions you know i have the redstone and i you know i just this is something i just found out i had a brewing stand because i went to a witch's house and killed her and took her brewing stand and uh yeah so as you can see you need blaze powder to get this shit going and you just fill up a bottle of water like so and uh yeah you know, I need that to get it going, and I also need the magma cream, and that'll make fire resistance. Then I can add redstone to increase the time limit. Crazy as shit to me, because I was just like, damn, that's the entire reason that I was going into the nether. Um, I wanted to make the fire resistance potions first. I thought that you could just make them first. I did not know that I had to wait. I did not know I had to find another fortress, so... I think that's what the gold is going to be for um, for now. I think that's what the gold is going to be. We're going to go to the nether itself here. And we're just going to see if we can... Uh, sorry, I'm kind of like a neat freak. We're going to see if we can find this nether fortress. I'm about to say portal. I mixed the words up. I was debating on whether or not I want to bring in the diamond armor and use it. Because I said that's what I was going to use the diamond armor for. You know, I said that's what I was going to use the diamond armor for. Um, but I'm thinking about just bringing in, thinking about just rocking this. Thinking about just rocking that for now. But see this, but then again, like, what's the point? Because, I mean, I've already made diamond armor. So it's like, that's why, that's what you went to the nether for. Ah, oh, fuck it. Nah, you know what? No. No. We're gonna rock diamond because that's that's why I made it. There's no point. Now, I don't think I should do need to bring the pickaxe though, because I'm not gonna be mining. I'm strictly looking for that uh that um actually why not just bring the brewing stand in? Now I'm thinking about it. No. Yeah. Yeah, let's just bring the brewing stand in. See, look, I've got fire protection on my boots. Okay, well, I got I'm breaking three and fire protection on, on. Oh, okay, cool. And we'll bring in the boots, and I'll just carry the boots on me. Clearly, we'll bring in these tools here. We'll switch these bad boys out. Just going ahead and throw this away. I've got. Okay, nice. I got plenty of space on my hard drive now, so that's pretty good. 
Okay, and we'll keep the diamond boots on us just in case. All right. Uh, of course, leaving the dog here. It's too dangerous out in that world, man. It's too dangerous out there. That's right. So before I do that, I'm just going to go up here and clean this. So we're looking for, we're going to be looking for another... go let's see what end up happening y'all oh well he's he's still accurate as ever let's see I can get them just to fall down come on damn it come on I know you want to fall go ahead go on go on get That's right. Bye bye. Okay. Oh, damn it. No. Oh, no. I fucked up. No. Damn it. I don't want to block this because if I block it, I think it'll stop the water. Oh, no. Okay. That won't stop it. Nice. Okay. I'm not gonna lie, y'all. I promised myself this would be an organic run. And then if I fucked up, that he scared me. Uh -huh. You always got shitty ass trades, bro. Uh -huh. <laughs> He, he can hang. He can hang around here for a bit. Or I'll uh, go to the Nether. Okay, um, let's do it, man. Let's navigate the Nether. This is quite scary, guys. Alright y'all, here we are. Now, that's good that we have magma cubes down here. That's the only thing I don't like about this damn spawn, is that they spawn me in the middle of the basalt biome. Like out of all the biomes to spawn me in, I now need to figure out and navigate my way down through this fucking treacherous biome. One thing I will do though, let's go on ahead and just take a screenshot of my coordinates here. So that way I know exactly where my base is, because... Traversing this. Oh, you know what I forgot to get to? Oh, no. You know what? When we get back, we can always go get go back and get the brewing stand. That's fine. Okay. How can we traverse this fucking landscape, bro? Nah, we got fire protection on the boots. And that's it. Okay. Yeah, just on the boots. I need these magma cubes, bro. Is there any safe way to get down? Look at how I have to get up here. No, 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 no. There has to be, no. I, I refuse to accept this. There has to be a better way to get down, like an easier way, because I'm going to eventually have to get back up here. So there's, you, you, there's no way, right? You're not telling me. I forgot that hurts you a little bit. Are you serious? Oh my god. Oh, nice. There you go. I don't want to be knocked off. So let me act accordingly here. Oh, they split up and shit. Oh, nice. There goes a biome over there. Sorry, y'all. I know I'm not talking as much, man. I just really got to concentrate. I'm not trying to die here. You know what I mean? Like, that would not be cash money. 
That would not be a turn on for the ladies. Look at that man. How much we get from that? Two? Okay. I don't know if that's because of a lot or not. Jesus Christ. Nice. There we go. Oh, yeah. And for those who aren't aware, for those who do not know, I'm wearing, the reason why I'm wearing this, uh, this stuff, gold, anyway, you know what, let's go put this back in the chest, you know, just real quick, just, you know, just real quickly, because this, this is important, guys, you know, this is, this magma cream, it's vital for our success, if we don't make it back with this magma, you know, if there's one thing I want to make it back with, it's the stuff of the potions, so now we just need the blaze stuff. You, he scared the shit out of me. I'm not gonna lie. There's several. I'm surrounded. What's up, bitch? Aerial assault by several of these entities. Y'all didn't know I used to... They used to call me Green Arrow back in the day. I'm about to die. I can feel it. Did I lose the potential magma cube? I mean, magma thing? That was supposed to be here? I'm confused about that. Where my shit at? Okay. We have seven. We have seven. Let's just remember that. Okay. We've got, we've still got plenty of arrows left. Okay. Let's navigate into that other area right there. I'll be happier when I get to that other area. And then we need to figure out where we can find another fortress axe. Get them blaze rods and come on back. Hey, buddy. Excuse me. Hey, pal. Oh, no. Oh, no. 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 I don't want to lose. Uh, okay. Yes. There we go. Nice. There we go. Nice. Okay. We're not going to put this away, though. This is really easy. I need to. Oh, shit. I lied. We are going to put this stuff away. It's going to be a long... Y'all, trust me. This is going to be a longer recording, okay? It'll be def it'll be worth it. I'm I am apologize. <gasps> I thought I was going to die to that lava, bro. I panicked. Oh, there goes the magma. I need it. Bitch! Okay, we're gonna put this away, y'all, then I swear I'm done. I promise you that I am actually done. Yeah, because we, we do need to get to going. We need to find this nether portal and everything so we can get the move on here. Let's, uh, let's do that. More of them are actually spawning close to my damn portal. We're definitely, we are definitely done on that. We are 110% definitely done on the magma cream. All right. Now, y'all, let's get to moving. And what I was going to say is the reason why we have gold on, for those who do not know, just a, a fun fact for those who might be brand new, he just killed himself. The, um, oh, another one committed suicide. You know, the, um, the reason why we are wearing this is because... You know, this is, uh, it's drip, son. On top of that, not only is it drip, but, uh, the wearing the gold boots prevents you from getting attacked by the piglins. See, that's one thing I never fuck with, is this music, bro. This damn, this damn music. 
in the nether. I know, like, it's meant to be ominous, so I understand. It's, it's, it's meant to be that way, because it's, you know, it's hell after all. It's not, it's not friendly. You know, friendly thought. Ooh, that was risky. That was a ballsy play. I'll see that. Whoa. Oh, an Enderman. Oh, this is the Enderman place. Okay. Now, how am I supposed to get down? That's my question. Like, how am I supposed to do that? I guess I could... I guess I can do this. This is why I bring extra blocks on me, y'all. You see? You always gotta be prepared, man. No, that's... I don't like that. Holy shit. Okay. Endermen, you know, Endermen, they won't fuck with you as long as you don't look at them. I'm not here to get into a staring contest with the Endermen. Okay. Well, we are a little bit safer. A little bit safer now. Uh oh, what's that? <gasps> no, no! I didn't look at him. Oh, okay. Oh, I need I need the warts too, I think. What is this? Crimson warts. Only reason I was afraid if I looked at him is because I don't know if I look at him, it's going to trigger all of them. If it does do it like the end does it, then that would be a problem. Okay, so we need to figure out how in the hell, uh oh. Yo, that's TJ Stafford over there. Okay. I don't fuck with this noise, bro, I really don't. I'm not gonna lie, y'all. I'm kind of lost. Oh shit! That fucking enderman scared me. I'm not gonna lie. I'm kind of lost here. I know we need to figure out. We need to traverse. <gasps> no! Oh my god! If it wasn't for fire resistance, if it wasn't for fire resistance, I would have lost all my shit right there. Are you serious? I'm, this is this is pure raw unedited gameplay, guys. It doesn't get more raw than this. This is more raw than picking up a hooker on the side of the street at 4:45 in the night time, preferably the a.m. Sure doesn't get any. We're still in the basalt area here. Let's just keep going this way. What is this? This is brand new. Twisting lines. Nice. We're starting to run into more nether rack. You know, digging down, y'all. That's a dangerous game now. You know what they say about digging down. Let's be real here. Efficiency. Now, remember, I've also got efficiency on this. Look at that. That's pretty quick. We don't want to use that though. We want to save that for now. Actually use this to traverse and keep going. Oh shit, my torches. Oh, okay. Maybe we're straight, we're straight, we're straight. This reminds me of back to my OG world, y'all. My very first world ever on the Xbox 360 edition when me and my friend got this game. Very first world ever, I shit you not. My game had a glitch that when you would enter the nether, your entire game would freeze. And it would just freeze and like you just couldn't enter the nether. And I was so obsessed with fixing it. And it was just a bug. It was just a bug because they even admitted it in the patch notes. And a whole bunch of other players had issues with it. But I refused to accept it. 
So on that world, on the Xbox 360 edition of Minecraft, I've got like over, I shit you not, probably over a hundred nether portals all across my world, just broken nether portals. Simply because I was so disturbed and I really wanted to get it to work. My friend didn't have any issues with it whatsoever. And I was just like, why is it doing it? I tried everything under the sun. You know, back in the day, you go on YouTube, you look up any kind of video you can to find stuff and, 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 and figure out what the hell you're doing right or wrong. And I was obsessed with that shit, but I could never find a solution, man. So I eventually just... It's like, fuck it, you know? Okay, well, we're getting away from the basalt region, which is good. We're deeper into this blue region, which is, that's fine. Actually, this will be a, a good place. I think they say that this is a good place to build down for, you know, I can start going straight down and start looking for uh, ancient debris. If I wanted to go down to level 14, I believe it is, but we're going we're gonna to save that for another time. We're looking for these blaze rods. I want that fire resistance potion, man. That's what we after, baby. In my mind, I'm taking a mental picture of like where my portal is, but I'm lost already. I feel it. You know, the fact that I haven't ran into any other mobs other than Enderman is also spooking me out. You know, the ominous music doesn't help. And, uh, yeah, it's just... Um, oh, Pigman. Why are they chasing? Why are they running? I got gold. Okay, never mind, never mind, never mind. Sure, sure, sure. Nice. Hey, guys, look at me. I've got gold on. I almost didn't look at them because I forgot. You can look at them. You can't. You just can't look at them. Now, they won't attack me, right? Because those are just piglins. I mean, pig men. They're friendly as well. They should leave me alone. Unless I attack one of them, then all of them will be mad at me. As long as I don't mind their gold in front of them, and I don't hit them, or I don't hit these fucking pigmen, I should be okay. <gasps> oh my god. Y'all, see? You know, it's all in the mental, man. It's all in the mental because I'm thinking about it so damn much. Because I'm thinking about this shit so damn much. That's exactly why my ass would do some stupid, silly shit and end up falling in lava that I shouldn't even fall in. Guys, do you happen to know where a portal is, perhaps? So what are the things that are not friendly in here no matter what? So gas, they're not friendly. I know that. Yeah, so we don't want to go back to that biome. Let's just keep on going this way. Oh, look at the baby. going this way <clears throat> so that'll be the plan man so we'll find this we'll find this portal you know what I should have done in all actuality I should have brought some obsidian in here with some flint and steel some extra obsidian now thinking about it had had a foresight to bring that in here so that way I could just make a, a portal and then just get out when I find the fortress instead of having to traverse my way all the way back that probably would have been the best way to go about things. But it's all good. Makes it more realistic. <gasps> no way. No way. No way. No way. No. 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 No way. No way. No way. I'm dead. I'm dead. 